All right, let's definitely go Western U.S. Um, yeah, we could go. Yeah, okay, we'll do this. All right. So we're going to go Lake Tahoe. I'm going to rent 572 Delta Juliet. And we're going to go... Uh, we're going to go to Reno. I hope. Yeah, Reno. We're going to carry three passengers. Hera, Hera's VIP passengers from Tahoe to Reno. And we're going to click on my flight. We're going to fly for snack air. Um, I'm going to leave, I'm going to just cancel these, this Flagstaff to Gallup because I couldn't get my 208 working properly, but we'll cancel that. Uh, so three passengers, we need to refuel. Well, let's get the ideal fuel level. Uh, if we calculate... So yeah, we'll load up KTVL. We'll go customize at the ramp. And we'll start that. And we'll come back here and we'll do fuel calculator. Three passengers in the Skyhawk. Max fuel is 45 gallons. Click the refuel. And we'll go Calvary Aviation 40 gallons. We're going to be slow. And we're also at altitude. So that's going to be an interesting scenario. All right. All right. How are we doing? Are we still here? Am I still live? Yep, okay, good. We're going to go on to Pilot Edge. Yep. And we're going to test the new audio. Now, I need to find out a frequency of how to get to, I'm assuming it's going to be NorCal Approach. Then I'm going to need to find a frequency for it, Lake Tahoe, to get a clearance. And then th the other thing, too, is I don't know what the route's going to be. So I'm just going to file SWR EHF and see what happens. No, I can't go EHF. That's like f way far away. Never mind. Wait, hold on. Maybe I'm right. We got a subscribe. This looked like the intense concentration edition of we the John got a Fly Flight. Yes, intense concentration of the John Fly Flight. Yes, for sure. 757 Spy. We got a sub crab. A shout out to 757 Spy. Appreciate you being here. Thanks for the support. Hope you had a good flight this morning. I see that you've been streaming um, last couple of days. I've been, I've been a lurking. A lurky lurker. All right, KTVL to Reno. I'm going to see if I can get a rote. Um, Shoal to Spoon FMG. I'll just file via FMG. That's fine. Uh oh, is my wing in the building? Uh oh. That's not good. Come over here. 
Lurking can be fun, exactly. Yeah, I tuned in yesterday, and you were having, I think, some microphone problems. But I think it, I, I thought it was just the distance that you, you had that microphone down low. I, but then I think you sorted it out sh uh, shortly thereafter. Let's go over here to the GA tie down. 127.95 Oakland for departure services. Thank you. Thank you, Neil. Yeah, if you guys aren't following 757 spy, give him a follow. He's he's probably the probably the best 757 pilot we have in out there on Twitch, to be honest. A lot of uh a lot of hours spent in that in that beautiful bird. I like it, except I don't like the pencil. Just thinking about it. Clarence is 134.3. Well, is Clarence, well, so what, which one is it then? Is it 127.95 or 134.3? Because I can't call for Clarence at Lake Tahoe because it's not a covered area. I mean, I can call for Clarence on the ground just to up to center or approach or departure, yeah, center. Yeah. Okay, now we're situated. Okay. Beautiful bird. All right, battery on. Beacon on. Mixture full. Parking brake on. Crack the throttle. Just pop up and f and file on frequency. I'll file on the ground, but all right, alternator on, avionics on. Mm, that's the other thing is. Well, no, I'll just fly that way. That's fine. Um, one, two. Squawk twelve hundred until we get a squawk code. If you want to pop up contact 127.9 or 5 in the air, which is center. Okay, so that would be Oakland Center. All right, we'll go over here to plugins, pilot edge, connect. Oh, it it ripped out all of my it ripped out all of my credentials. That's not good. Hmm. Cuz I uninstalled the old client. Uh oh. All right, we gotta log back in. I don't know what my password is. Oakland Center, okay. I think that's my password. Connected to Pilot Edge. All right. Let's, uh, now you're saying 127.9 or 5? All right. Set COM 1, blah, blah, blah. Set COM 1, 127.95. COM 1 set to 127.9 or 5. Let's see if we'll hear anyone. Uh, we're going to go pilot edge. I'm looking forward to hearing this new audio. They've got this new audio. Hey, oh, that's, how do I, how do I turn on that new audio? Uh, the new modification, or is that automatic? Oh, we'll find out, I guess. All right, we're 172 slant golf. Oops. Golf. Directional gyro, that's fine. And we're going KTVL. K. K R and O, and we're going just F M G. All 
uh, KFMG, and we're going to go at uh, 7,000. Is that high enough? 7 to 15. I think I'm going to circle around the lake until I get up to... I guess we'll go to 13. Maybe we should just depart VFR, get out over the mountains south of Reno, and then call up for call up for a clearance, uh, an IFR clearance uh, when we're south. But then again, yeah, let's do that. All right, so we'll depart VFR, and then we'll file uh, in the air once we're out of the mountain range. Uh, and we'll just file 7,000 for now. Douglas 6, Sierra Uniform, Roger, advise one back. Oh, that's the new audio. UPS uh, 1686, uh, Phoenix, now good morning, runway 25 left, quit for takeoff, wind uh, Two nine zero at seven. Okay, let's turn the taxi lights on. We're gonna lean for taxi. Yeah, that sounds pretty good. It does sound like a radio. It really does. I think I see a poly over there. Hey, what? TCV, how you doing? Uh, no, this is the default Cessna that comes with X-Plane. Sounds really good. I'm really excited about that. Dogs, how you doing? Happy Saturday. EPS 1696, contact login. departure. FS Economy auto login. Uh, uh, I'm going from Lake Tahoe to Reno. Um, so I'll take off from Lake Tahoe, South Lake Tahoe, fly around the lake a little bit, get up to altitude, fly over the mountain range, down into the valley, uh, just south of Reno, and then we'll call for a, a clearance. Actually, I could call for a clearance now. EPS 696, uh, departure. Good afternoon, air contact. Climb and maintain. Flight level 210. It's a little bit loud, isn't it? Let's go sound. Yeah, they have been at an all time low, Tylenol. They have been. I, I've noticed that, yeah. New code for formation flying as as well, but haven't tried it out yet. Oh, we should do another, we should do another group flight, um, Val dudes. We should we should do that. I've I've missed those quite a bit actually.
Yeah, do you want to do it in the cub again, or do you want to try something new? Like, do you want to go in the uh, DA62? You know what would be kind of fun uh, is they if we all jumped in uh, vision jets, because they have the HDCSL for all the vision jets. You were on Pallet Edge the other day, weren't you, Val dudes? Yeah, just putting around. Nice. This is one of the most downloaded liveries in default Cessna Skyhawk history. There's like 600 downloads. It's viral. Micro lights, yeah. Well, the problem with micro lights is that it's hard to go very far. Whatever, runway, whatever, clear for takeoff. There you go. I got to do a run up, though, because I got to go to the. I need a quick Bravo India Oscar break. All right, quick, quick bathroom break. I'll be right back. Do you guys want me to take the camera with me? No. Yeah, 1686, contact Albuquerque Center, 134.32 for hire. Hey, it's AJ. Yeah, 1686, Albuquerque Center, climb and maintain, flyable 320. Wonder if I should file them. Nah, I'll file from the air. That's fine. Okay, uh, landing lights on, nav lights on, strobe lights on, taxi lights off, fuel pump on. Let's go full mixture. Six air uniform, uh, correction, remember six air uniform Albuquerque Center, Roger. Yeah, it's normal, it's Unicom, but there's no one here, so I, I don't know, for some reason I don't, sim I should simulate it, but I don't. I should practice it, but it's not, it's not on, yeah, it's not on the network. It's not covered. It's not a, to a, co a covered tower. Density altitude's real here. At least I hope it's not covered. <laughs> Let's 
Enjoy see. your Ooh. snack air flight. Cold beer on tap. Left overhead. Thank you. What is the name of this field? Is it, is it South Lake Tahoe? Yeah. Uh, Lake Tahoe, red and white Cessna 5729 Romeo uh, departing the area. Of, uh, we'll be flying over the lake, various VFR altitudes headed to Reno eventually, South Lake Tahoe, <laughs> or just Lake Tahoe. We might I might go over yeah, we'll go over the lake a little bit and then we'll call in. Plane seems to be operating pretty well with four passengers and almost full fuel. She's doing pretty well, actually. I'm going to cut right through that opening in the mountains. And then after that, we'll call in for a clearance. Turn our autopilot on. We'll go into vertical speed mode. We'll climb up at 400 feet for now. Sync up our heading bug and go heading mode. And then that'll also give me an opportunity to program in my uh, flight plan. So FPL, menu, delete flight plan. And we'll go cursor active I want to go to FMG first Mustang the Mustang VOR and then Reno Might get something different though. We'll find out. Oh, Stalin. Not not the Russian Stalin either. Uh, yes, Neil, I got the GPS hardware panel for the 530 and the 430, but my 430 is, um, I, f I have to troubleshoot the USB 
or the Arduino board. It's not talking to the Arduino board right now. So. There is that. Oh. I guess we can just get flight following. How do you call for flight following again? Let's see. Got to review my VFR technique. Center, 133.55. We'll see you later. Really like that audio. Alright, we're going to go down here and then shortly we're going to turn north. Yep. We can say that we're just. Uh, yeah, we're about eight miles northeast of. Yeah, let's see what happens. Uh, and we'll go up to... Actually... Yeah, we'll go up to 8,500. Actually, we're going eastbound, so we better... Let's go to 7,500, so let's go down. Oakland Center, November 572 Delta X-ray, a Cessna Skyhawk uh, slant golf, approximately nine miles northeast of uh, Lake Tahoe Airport. Uh, request flight following to Reno at uh, VFR altitudes. Delta X-ray, runner, try North California approach on 119.2 with your request. Uh, 19.2, thanks, 572 Delta X-ray. Remember, 6 here, uniform contact, Albuquerque approach. Set COM 119.20. One 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 COM 1 set to 119.2. Er North Cal approach, 572 Delta X-ray, Cessna Skyhawk, approximately 10 miles northeast of the Tahoe uh, Airport, uh, request flight following to Reno at 7,500. So 116 here, uniform, Albuquerque approach, Roger. They're actually landing three and eight right now. Uh, did you have an RNAV approach or one of those runways? From okay, expect runway three and uh, plan the ILS approach. I guess that works for you. If you have another request, please advise. Information to India is now current. Remember 572 Delta X ray, North Cal approach, squawk 3767, maintain VFR. 3767, maintain VFR, 572 Delta X ray. All right, squawk code. Three, seven, six, seven. Maintain VFR. Yeah, I normally it would have given him a VOR, but I was so far from any VOR, so. And I thought he'd have me do an ident, but he's probably got me on radar.
So should we do an approach or should we just do the visual? It's kind of fun back in the sky, Hawk. Every 572 Delta X-ray radar contact, 25 miles south of Mustang VOR, altitude indicates 7,800, maintain VFR. Uh, advise current weather for Reno, should be landing on 16 left, 16 right, information November. All right, we'll grab November and expect uh, 16 left or right, 572 Delta X-ray. Uh, barometric pressure is 3016, that's why we're off a little bit. All right, let's grab the weather at Reno. All right, November's current, 1806, visibility 108,000 scatter, 15,000 scatter, 25,000 scatter, temperature 33, density altitude 2.9, altimeter 3010, visual approach 16 left, 16 right in use, uh, bird activity in the vicinity, and approaches on parallel runways are in effect. All right. Uh, NorCal Approach 572 Delta X-ray has November, and uh, visual will be great. Two Delta X-ray, expect runway 16 left. Expect 16 left, 572 Delta X-ray. November 116 here, uniform flighting 080 vectors, final approach course, descend to maintain 10,000. Maintain one zero thousand ten thousand. Once you're I need verification of the altitude. You read back something different. Maintain a one zero thousand ten thousand. Yeah, I'm really digging the new uh, audio codec for Pilot Edge. Really uh, digging it. I'm sorry, I didn't catch your last transmission with regards to that. That's fine. Yeah, just uh, let me know uh, when you're ready to continue.
Sky 2 Delta X ray, expect a left downwind for 1 6 left, advise when you have the field in sight. Expect left downwind, we'll advise in sight, 5 7 2 Delta X ray. Definitely do not have the field in sight. No, oh, maybe. Maybe with the binoculars I do. Yeah, with the binoculars I do. Okay, approach 572 Delta X ray has field in sight. Number 2 Delta X ray, enter, enter left downwind, or runway 16 left. I'll have a handoff to the tower for you shortly. Enter left downwind, 16 left, 572 Delta X ray. Cool, fun. Do you guys like the audio? I like the audio. I guess there's a way to turn it off, but I haven't. I, I I'm not gonna turn it off. I'll leave it on. It's 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 GG. You like it, Watt? Yeah, it's pretty good. All right, pattern altitude at Reno is uh, 54. So we're gonna descend down to 5,400. Actually, pattern altitude is 5,400, so yeah. We'll go to Earth, yeah, 5,400, give or take. All right, uh, Reno Tower is 118.7. Uh, We're also going to park it. Atlantic, so maybe we get off at uh, Juliet. Need to get myself a new mic and start doing those cat ratings again. Yeah, be, uh, yeah. I've never done the cat ratings. I before they had the cat ratings. They had the V ratings, and I passed all the V ratings, and then I went to the I ratings to end them up through five. I got I got to do the I six next. I hear the I ten is the most difficult, but Still got loads. To, yeah, they're, it's cool that they have the training program. I do like that. All right, we're in, entering the Clash Charlie Airport. Um, we need to be in two-way radio communication with uh, air traffic control when we enter into a Clash uh, Charlie. There's six air uniform radar contact lost. Weird, we got this little mountain here. So I wonder if what they normally do, because the field's right Jack there. Delta X-ray contact Reno Tower one one eight point seven. Over to Tower, thanks. Tell two Delta X-ray.
Reno Tower, 572 Delta, X-ray entering a left downwind, 16 left. Remember, 572 Delta X-ray, Reno Tower, Roger, runway 16 left, clear to land, so into 180 at 6. 16 left, clear to land, 572 Delta X-ray. All right, so when I get a landing clearance, I'm pretty much free to do whatever I wanted to do, right? So I could, within reason, right? You want to stay, so, you know, want to stay in the pattern. You don't want to extend your, your uh, downwind too far. But if I wanted to, I, I could fire up the uh, ILS and I could just vector myself for an ILS approach and then engage the ILS uh, approach if I wanted to. Um, you could advise them that you're just going to do a practice approach from such and such. But, you know, when you're cleared for, to land, you're, you, you could pretty much do what you want, except you don't want to go too far out to, like, say, a, an initial approach fix its way out there. But in this case, we'll just enter the, you know, we'll just do a basic visual and we're, we're at pattern altitude now. So we're on six area in the form of Albuquerque approach, I dump. Oh, in fact, I'm going to tighten this up just a little bit here. Number six area uniform, thanks, radar contact two zero, correction, I'm sorry, radar contact two five miles southwest of Albuquerque, flighting zero nine or zero, maintain a one zero thousand. Number six area uniform, continue descent, maintain nine or thousand. There is a cross runway that we want to stay east of. I don't want to fly over that runway. even though it's not in use right now. Taco 83, hello. There's the field, and there's Atlantic, where we're going to be parking there on the uh, east side. Why is there a headset icon in the upper? That's my voice command, right? So, um, I'll slow down here, and we'll put in. Well, I'll use the voice command to put in the flaps here. But that lights up when I have when I'm, my voice is active, you know. This is where track IR would come in handy. Okay, get down to 1700 RPM or so. Well, we can get the lower end of the green arc. Beautiful ortho. Okay, my airplane. Autopilot is off. Dip our nose a little bit. Flaps one. Down to flaps one. Start my base turn. Kind of 
kind of a squabbly base turn. We'll straighten it up here a little bit. And let's turn it to final. We're six here, uniform set to maintain 8,000. That's where it's easier to do is those uh, turns to final with track IR, so. Another notch of flaps. Mixture full. Go ahead and get your landing guesses in now. Wind uh, is four at three two six. Uh oh. Pretty light. Will I land this harder or softer than the 7-2? <laughs> it's a little bit windy. Number 6 here, uniform turn left, heading 0 six zero, intercept the runway 3, localizer. Yeah, 101. Number six here, uniform Flap is, zero. Uh, three miles from Flaps 50, going up all the way. Until established on the localizer, cleared ILS runway three approach. 101. Oh, did uh, RC Flyer get... Oh, oh, oh. Whoa. We missed our turn off. We're going to exit it at Lima. Landing lights off. Flight director off. <laughs> Leave those landing lights on until we exit the runway. RC flyer almost got it right on, huh? Landing lights off. Landing lights off. Taxi lights on. Taxi lights on. Fuel pump off. Fuel pump off. Reno Tower 572 Delta X-ray is clear of 16 left at uh, Lima. Request taxi to Atlantic. Bye bye. Sky 2 Delta X-ray taxi via Charlie to Atlantic. Monitor ground point under. We'll see. Charlie to Atlantic, uh, monitor ground, point niner. So yeah, 572 Delta X-ray. Okay, we switched over to ground. San Francisco clearance, Southwest, 4183, good afternoon. Information, Papa, IFR to Las Vegas, McCarran International. Southwest 4183, San Francisco clearance. Good afternoon, clear to Las Vegas Airport. Stick three departure, Intel transition. Then is filed. Climb via the SID, except maintain a 10,000. Squawk 5354. That's interesting how. New Las Vegas, McCarran International, via the stick three departure, Intel transition is filed. Climb via the SID, except maintain 10,000. Squawk 5354, Southwest 4183. Southwest 4183, read that correct? All right, good job, RC Flyer. We'll give you some. We'll give you two Hunsky for that one. 